back on camera Ten toes down, boy, you niggas need to man up Took a couple falls, but it was nothing to stand up Got right in my bands up, had to switch the plan up Everybody rapping like Chirac on like Atlanta Monkeys do a monkey see, so we brought bananas If they get out of line, we gon' have to teach them manners I ain't here for no rap beef, I'm here to raise the standards Talking sideways Hey, what's going on, family? What's happening with you? What's happening with your bro, son? Definitely in the building. You know me. Another great day. Just finished washing my face. You know, rituals as usual. It's my rose oil. Get yours today. Definitely in the times of overall health and everything, you want to make sure that you are a healthy individual. You don't want to be around unhealthy individual mentally, spiritually. Emotionally, definitely physically, alright? So you already know the daily routine. Let me tell you what, what's so great about doing your rituals and stuff like that, right? When you eating right, and you living right, and you doing things correctly, it lets people know that you actually are on, game, on point, on game, understand life, understand that everything has a, has a meaning and everything is done for a reason. You know what I'm saying? So you want to be able to definitely keep your bearings in, in, in play. And this is not an opinion. This is a fact. And that's what we're going to talk about today. Today's um, frequency is 432, nature. All right? Always keep your frequencies high because we're dealing with some low-frequency people. All right? Now... Let's talk about opinions and facts, right? A lot of people be talking about, oh, it's just their opinion. Like they say, opinions is like an asshole. Uh, opinions is like an asshole. Everyone has an opinion. But when your opinion is not based upon a fact, then it's just you just talking, right? For instance, and, I, and I'm going to say this out, out and out. Transgender is a mental, a mental disability. It's a mental illness, right? Because I'm going to tell you why. If you are transgender, right? And and I'm, go, I'm just going to say this. You women cannot expound upon the transgender when it's a man wanting to be a woman. Because this is a man's issue. Homie, you're a man. And people's opinion is is they want to defend transgender. I don't know why you want to... Let me tell you something, right? And I'm not talking about... And I'm going to be biased here. I'm not talking about the women that want to be men because they already know. you. See, the thing about women is when they want to be men, it's for a sexual thing with a woman. They're not trying to be us. They're not trying to infiltrate us like that. You know, some are. They want to get... They want to have... They want to look like... Like me, they want to have the long hair, the scruffy beard, and but they also know they part. They're not trying to get into sports and all that, and they don't be acting like them. The, you know the men that be running around here acting flamboyant like they're really women and be trying to really play themselves out of pocket. And, that, and 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 those of you who don't know, ain't nobody running around here trying to just hunt down transgender men and kill them. Nine times out of ten, because they got a fly ass mouth, they did or said something that got them ended up beat the fuck up or dead. Or oh, some of them were really all gangsters and they're in prison. So don't think that people run around here just doing things to transgender men. That's not what it is. But what, it, what, what America doing is creating this atmosphere. This is not an opinion, this is a fact. They're creating an atmosphere. Joe Biden is creating an atmosphere. You know, because nobody, okay, Black Lives Matter, y'all a bunch of lesbians. Who cares? Who cared about that? But y'all cramming transgenderism, not homosexuality, just that section of transgender men down the throats of people like, y'all better respect them or else. Or else what? That's what I'm saying. Or else what? Let me tell you this, and I'm going to tell you this to these transgender people, transgender men, and people who want to defend transgenders in general. Y'all not built for a war with the whole world. Y'all are crazy. 
That's why I'm saying it's a mental disease. Or what? What the fuck you going to do if we don't respect you? I had a, a, a guy say that they, they, they like people do stuff to them for no reason. Nobody ain't doing nothing. There's no transgender men for no reason. But Joe Biden is saying you respect transgender men or else. He's telling other countries that he going to put sanctions on them if they don't accept transgender men because he decided to, to put on a transgender man for men's, for health. Which I'm definitely not listening to. I don't care what nobody say. I listen to myself with help. It ain't got nothing to do with the transgender man in general. I don't care if they had a regular man or a regular woman. I'm not listening to you when it comes down to help at all. I'm not listening to the government when it comes down to help. I do my own research. I do independent research. I'm not listening to no government and they and they giving you a shot that's gonna kill you. Yeah, right. I don't give a damn. But in, in, in the fashion that you're telling people you're you're, you're gonna respect them. Let me tell you something, right? And there was a transgender man in the men's bathroom in the gym. I respected him. And I told him that. I said, you know why I respect you? He said, why? I said, because you still know that you're a man even though you dressed up like a girl, but you're in the men's bathroom. You're not in the girls' bathroom. I respected that. I respected that. And he said, no, no, he said, thank you. And I just kept it pushing. I respected that because you know what? I do not agree with transgender men using a woman's bathroom. I do not agree with transgender, and it's not an opinion, it's a fact. Because if my daughter's in the bathroom and the man goes into the girl's bathroom and she tell me your daddy that the guy whipped out this thing and I'm beating his ass, I don't care what you're talking about. That's not an opinion, that's a fact. And, and, and call my bluff if you want to. I'm, I'm tired of everybody just scared to talk about transgender men because, no, if you want to be a transgender, do your numbers. But what you're not going to do, because I'm a man. And the women ain't can't do nothing. What you're not going to do is tell me because you're a transgender man. I'm too supposed to respect you. Now, you tell them, you telling me, and like I said, Joe Biden treating this atmosphere that's going to backfire. And then when people start hunting them down, just say that Joe Biden caused this atmosphere by trying to make people respect them. I'm going to tell you this, right? A person like me got to go outside every day. And I don't worry about it, but it's on my mind that I might run to a cop that might be on some prejudice shit that might try my, try my luck. And I'm going to try his jaw straight up. So you mean to tell me their rights is more effective than me just living on the strength of? And people are actually advocating for these people? Let them advocate for themselves. I'm not saying don't do your thing. But y'all actually, so what? I, yeah, because it's a man's issue. It's a mental issue. So if I'm, and, and women, women's like, why are you so worried about trans men? Because I'm a man. And a lot of y'all women think that niggas is bitches. Because look how y'all talk to men. Talk to me like that in my face, not spit in your face. Dead ass. Because a lot of y'all be feeling, right? And I'm not talking about women. Because I, I, I got, trust me. If a woman get in my face, I got somebody else for that. <laughs> I don't have to get my hands on you for that. Trust and believe that, right? But understand this, right? I talk, when I say transgender, men, women, mind your neck. This is a man's issue here. I can say what I want about another man because you know why? These gay guys, not really, it's these gay men, and these transgender men got y'all women thinking that we on some feminine shit. You got these bitch ass niggas running around here. I'm talking about men in general that got y'all thinking that all men, especially the original men, is on some feminine shit. Y'all got the game twisted because we all ain't like that. Trust me. I know a bunch of straight men that's not on no gangster shit, but will violate you as soon as you think that we like one of them. That's the problem. Y'all be like, look at the country. You got people stepping out thinking that they can just talk to the original man the way they want to. Original men, I'm going to tell y'all, y'all need to put a halt to that. If you see a transgender man running around here thinking he's a chick, remind him he's a man. Remind him, because I am. I don't see them. And I go everywhere. I don't see them. Just like people don't say nothing about my, my mask. I'd be looking at me like women and men in the gym is looking at me. They're like, shit, he don't got his mask on. Taking mine's off. Nobody say nothing to me. And it's crazy because you got women.
Stop be saying, why are you worried about what another? Because at the end of the day, yeah, it's not me, but it's a representation. Representation. Because what do y'all do out there in the streets when you see a a so-called quote unquote? And now you know I don't like using that word black, but when you see a so-called quote unquote black man, you say black men like this. You don't say that that type of black man like that. You say black men. I put this all in one in one bubble. No, black men don't like that. Black men don't want to be prettier than they woman. No, we don't want to act like a bitch and record. Because real, original men is not recording it. They fighting. They fighting. Mess with us if you want to. I'm recording. Just imagine somebody coming out of their pot, out of the side of their mouth to me and I start recording. But I'm going to give you a prime example. I was in a, I was watching my son. He was playing with his, with his friends. And we was at a mall one day. And... They was playing football on the field, and this this mall cop came up there and was yelling at the kids. And I'm looking, I'm like, oh, snap. And, you know, he, he dipped off. So I'm like, yeah, I'm going to see if he's going to do that again. I'm sitting on the bench. I got a hoodie on. My son come up there. My son don't know what's going on. He's throwing the football with his friends. They take the football from him. I jump up. I said, yo, give him back his football. I ain't no why what why, i said show me the policy give him back give him back give my son back his football and, I, and i'm swearing up on him so the original man officer sees me he slides over there hey just give him back his football they already knew it was about to get ugly straight up you think i'm gonna pull out my phone here and record this nobody recorded it that's why i said it should be phone it'd be set up ain't nobody worried about recording and I did it because he took a football from a bunch of kids and was down at the kids. And then the little kids gonna come to him, Caucasian kids, Latino kids, original kids, told me thank you. Cause he been he be harassing them. I'm about to put these things on them. Yeah, that's me. I'm gonna put them things on them. You were messing around with children and they can't defend themselves. Well guess what? Now you got somebody that's your equal. What's up? What's good? Transgender men sit there talk to little children and try to convert them facts because you don't see transgender women talking to little girl trying to convert them on a what why why broad scale it's not an opinion this is a fact it's a mental illness and you think you're a woman if that's okay that's like saying think you're a millionaire and go out there and try to use your credit card and and and, and see what you get out of that think you're a millionaire go and buy that Bentley that you always wanted with your credit card because you, that's a mental illness to think that you got something that you not. It's not. Yeah, I got, I got, look, my dog whipped this up. I'm going to use this gift card right here. And I'm going to go and buy me a Bentley and a brand new mansion. Because I identify that there's a trillion dollars on this card. It's a mental, and I actually go out and attempt to use this card, this shoot up card. I attempt to go outside and use it. That's a mental illness. You cannot tell me that a trans man is not mentally ill. You can be gay all you want. You can think that you want some penis in your butt all you want. But the fact of the matter is you think you're a woman. You want to dress up like a woman. You want to change your appearance. And you want to identify as a woman. Knowing biologically you are a man. That is a mental illness. It's been a mental illness all the way up until the Democratic Party pushed that is not a mental illness. It's been a mental illness for decades. Especially if you think you're a woman. You're not no woman. You're still a man. So when you act out, you get treated like a man. So y'all can... And, 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 you know, I just had to say that. It's not an opinion. Opinions is... Well... I think this might work. It says it's four of our free. It should work. My opinion is it tastes better than the other um the other fluoride toothpaste I got. That's the, my opinion. The fact of the matter is fluoride free toothpaste do not destroy the bone marrow in your mouth. While well, fluoride actually eats away it's a toxin. That's a fact. So all that just people saying their opinion, fuck your opinion. Your opinion doesn't mean nothing in a fact. The fact of the matter is they're not women, they're men, and they need to be treated as such. And for you women out there, stop defending them. Stop. Stop defending them. We don't defend R. Kelly. We ain't did the bullshit. So stop defending these guys that think they're women. They're not women. They're men. They got a mental illness. They literally need to be taking, they need to see a therapist. 
You could be gay, but you're not a woman. Stop defending them. Facts. That's a fact. 